The next event on screen you can see is the third he heat of the under 12 boys, 800 metres. We have 16 competitors in the start line right now. And we'll let them get underway and we'll introduce the field to you. On your marks. And as the athletes get on their way, we'll introduce the field to you right now. From the inside, we have Tristan from Werribee in Station 1, 2, Oliver from Keelor, 3, Sullivan from Mowie, 4, Nate from Keelor, 5, Tomek from Brighton, 6, Alfie from Collingwood, 7, Max from Pakenham, 8, Kevin from Cranbourne, 9, Andrew from Caulfield, 10, Riley from Box Hill, 11, Ethan from Berwick, 12, Cooper from Caulfield, 13, Rehan from Berwick, 14, Callan from Werribee. 15, Benjamin from Echuca Moama. And in station 16, Patrick from Bacchus Marsh. So as they make their way around for the first time, it is the athlete from Keelor that's out in a convincing lead. We'll just get some vision on who he might be. Just so we can determine out of the two athletes who we're talking about. So it's Oliver Sabel from Keelor that's got a convincing lead out in the front at the moment. So sit in second at the moment, we have our athlete from Moe Sullivan. Then we've got our Collingwood athlete, Ian Elfie. Box Hill and Berwick athletes just following closely behind. But this is the athlete out in front, Oliver Sobel. So we'll just see if we can get some data on Oliver to determine his season's best this year. Oliver is capable of about a three-minute run. So he's ran two 800s this season. And the system's telling me that he's actually run them almost equally the same. He is starting... The legs are starting to get heavy and that pack behind him is starting to chase him down. Does look like the athlete from Berwick is hot on his tails. And that athlete is Ethan. So we'll see Ethan as he comes up over the shoulder just now of our Caulfield athlete. And if Ethan, get, Ethan gets this around, it's going to be a quick time, but there's going to be another late charge by the Box Hill athlete as well now. So... The athlete ch changes are actually making it quite significant here. I think Riley is going to have the intention to run him down in these final stages. So we'll just see how Riley goes. But it does look like our athlete from Berwick, Ethan, has had a little bit of a kick. It's going to come down to close and he's just held on. Great effort, both of those boys. Then we have our athlete from Moe in third, which is Sullivan. Next was our C Collingwood athlete in Alfie. With our remaining competitors making their way down the front straight in their final event for the day. And a big congratulations to our Chukamoa athlete in that field. They are our furthest traveling athlete in this race today. And with our final competitor making their way across the line now, that is the end of the third heat of the under-12 boys, 800 metres.